Hey, it's Jess from Tech with Jess. And today I'm going to show you how to create a proposal using Hello Bonsai. Hello Bonsai is a software for independent contractors or freelancers. And it can do everything from creating proposals to contracts, to invoices, time tracking, accounting, and so on. So it's definitely a great software if you are looking for something to help you run your business. So when you come to create a proposal, this will pop up. You will see some different templates that they have or that you saved, and you can select the one that you like. So you can preview it here. And if you like the look of it, you can go ahead and use it. So every time you create a proposal, you will select what client this is for and the project name. So I'm going to select a client by clicking on this drop down. You can also add a new client right from here. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's give it a name and the email, and then we will give this a project name. So let's create proposal. So it went ahead and added my business name in my email. This is the from, and then this is the client's information. Again, it was populated, but sometimes you will have to enter that yourself. Up here we have the title. So I'm going to put tech. I can click here to edit and I can select an image to add here. Okay, so now I have this really nice picture here. So we can, again, remove it if we want to. We can edit some styles here. We have some different colors. We can change this background too. You can also change the border. And then there are some global styles. So let's scroll down. Here, this will populate automatically. So when it's sent and when it's accepted, down here we have some different text blocks. So we can come to this pencil and here you will see some different options to edit this. Now, maybe I don't want this to be a dark color. So maybe I wanna lighten it up. I could come to these colors and do so here. And then of course I can edit the text. And once you click on this, you'll see that you have some different options here. You can make it bold, italicized, underlined, and then you can add numbered list, bulleted list. You can also change the alignments. You can add, you know, increase or create a quote, hyperlink things, and you can also add more images here. And then you also have the option, which is really cool to create a video and attach it here. You can also use a divider and some emojis or emoticons. Okay, so this is a text block. You can edit it as you wish. Down here, they have some different content. So overview and goals, and it gives you an idea of what to add here. And then you can also have this fee structure. So you can select which one you would be using. You can set up packages. So this is a really neat feature here where you can have, you know, package A, you can write a description of what this is. So test one, test two, and so on. And you can give it a price. So one unit, we're going to do $100. And then it totals it up. So that would be one option. And then you could add more here, or you can completely change this, but that will erase what you already have. So if I want to add another package, I could do so here. And again, just add the different items of what I would include in that package. So they do have this extra one that pops up here, but it will disappear if you don't put anything there. So don't worry about that. Okay. And then at the end, you might want to finish with a thank you, sign your name, maybe leave your contact information again, just in case, or link to your website. If you want to add more blocks, you can click on this plus sign. And here you see all of these different sections. So we have text again, 
files and attachment, that might be one to add. So you can just click on it, include a file or an attachment. If you don't want that, you can remove it by clicking this button down here. And we also have some different sections about us, text and border, text and image, a banner image. So you can use these to make your proposal more customized. So once you are satisfied with this, you can preview it. So here we will come up to preview and you can see what it will look like to the potential client. We have the fees and all of the text that we wrote. If you want to keep editing, you can go back here or you have some other options. So you can edit it, you can duplicate it, download it, archive it, which makes it disappear, but it's not gone forever. Or you can actually delete it or save it as a template. You might wanna reuse this for future projects. So I definitely recommend doing that. Have a template that you can use every time or you can view the project, which, which will take you out to view what you are doing with that project. If I want to send it to the client, I will click up here on resume editing and send the proposal. So every time you do this, it will pop up this window where you can edit this message to them. This will be with the proposal. So they will get an email with this message from you and they will click to view the proposal in a link. So you can customize this for every client if you wish, or you can also set up to be default. This is my default message that I set up in my settings. So here you also have the option to automatically create an invoice when the client accepts this proposal. And that's a nice function. And then you can send the proposal via URL. So if you would rather do that and just send this to them in an email yourself or in Slack or whatever it is, you can do so by clicking that button. Bonsai will actually send reminder emails for you if you have that setting turned on. That way people aren't forgetting about your proposal to them. So if you want to do that, you can grab the URL or you can click send and it will go right to the client. So they should get pretty instantaneously and then they can go in and either accept it or deny it. I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have questions about Hello Bonsai or if you want a one month free trial, I do have an affiliate link that you can use to check it out. But I love this software. It makes my life so much easier and it's very affordable as well. So highly recommend it. But if you have any questions, feel free to drop them below. Thanks for watching this tutorial on how to create a proposal using Hello Bonsai. If you liked this video and other tech trainings, make sure to subscribe so you can get notified when a new video is released.